Gymshark is bringing back the flex. Don't worry, it's not what the flex. It's just the regular flex that we all love and know so well. I know we're a little divided over that what the flex, but we've moved on past that. <laughs> and now we are back here with some brand new flex colors. What's up my honeys? Welcome back to the channel. So last night I posted a poll on Instagram stories asking you which Gymshark video you would like to see next. It was between the flex or the energy because I don't know if you've heard, we got both launching this month. Release date TBC. I kept checking that poll every hour on the hour. I was curious to know like, which one are you guys preferring? It was neck and neck all night long. I was like at the edge of my seat here. <laughs> it wasn't until this morning when the flex really started pulling away with it. So I was like, all right, flex it is. You know, I don't think until recently I found out how popular the flex really is because I actually started taking notes at my own gym that I go to to see what type of active wear everybody's wearing. The gym that I go to actually is divided between two floors. You got the upper floor, which is light and airy and bright, mostly machinery and treadmills. But then you go downstairs in the basement. There's no windows. It's low lit. It's that body building grungy type of style black walls and everything. So it's like two polar opposites. But what I do notice is that most of the men and women wear Gymshark, whether it's upstairs or downstairs, they're wearing Gymshark. And I studied the gals at my gym and they're mostly wearing Adapt or Flex. What do you guys think? Comment down below. Do you wear a lot of Flex? I'm getting a ton of questions about where's the gym that Bay and I built together? That's a really good question. We were renting this space. The lease was up and we decided to give it a rest. We're actually putting all of our equipment in storage for now until Bay and I own a home and then we will be putting that into our own home gym. So the rent we were spending in that gym, we're just gonna turn around and save that money for a down payment on a house. That's just what we wanna do at this phase of our life. And if I'm being super honest, I really miss the culture of going to a gym. Like I felt 10 times more motivated when going and being around other people that are like-minded. You wouldn't believe the lack of motivation that came with just being in my small little space. It took a lot for me to actually get serious workouts in. Thank you so much to Gymshark for sponsoring today's video. I know that you guys saw these colors on my Instagram reel, right? Take a look at these hot spring colors we got going on. Is it too early to celebrate spring? No, it's not. Okay, not in my eyes. Once Christmas is over, I'm done with winter. Mentally, I am in spring palm tree mode. Physically, I'm in cold as f New Jersey right now with like a foot of snow outside. But guess what? This, my dears, this is what's gonna get me through this rough winter. <laughs> For real. If you have not already, definitely hit that subscribe button, especially if you are a fan of Gymshark because next up we have the new energy that we'll be launching this month. So hit that subscribe button, give this video a like if you found it helpful. And without further ado, let's try on these gorgeousnesses. Okay, so this was an unintentional mix and match. I actually didn't have the matching top to these bottoms and vice versa. So I think it was the universe telling me, Ash, you need to mix and match these two. I'm looking like a sun in the sky, man, on a summer day. Here I have that glitch yellow, that really bright neon yellow sports bra. Again, if you're unfamiliar with the Flex Collection, they have two styles of sports bras available. They got the strappy, the one I'm wearing right now, and they do a straightforward racer back. The strappy is adjustable. This baby is not, and it has a thick as band. In case you haven't seen by now, the Flex is known for their really big text. So you gotta love that Gymshark logo real big on the back here. It's a very bold collection. So you also have a very, very heavy contour throughout these sets. Now, not all of their pieces do have that heavy block contour. Some of the contour is the same color as the actual piece, but then they make up for it with a really thick contrasted band. But what I'm wearing right now is the high rise shorts. So the high rise shorts come as a biker style only. I really love the biker style. I feel like it's just the right length. These are actually what I love wearing on walks when the weather's a little bit warmer. The leggings, the high rise leggings are my favorite for the winter time because they are a little bit thicker than a lot of other Gymshark collections. So keep that in mind if you're in cold weather, thickness is important. 
you need a little insulation, all right? Thin leggings sometimes just don't cut it, so keep that in mind. If you look closely, this yellow has a grayish silver logo, which could be paired with other gray pieces in this collection. Do you guys remember when Gymshark came out with this color like two years ago for the Flex? You remember? I don't have it on hand because that's stored away my summer stuff, but if my memory serves me correctly, they actually came out with this color a couple of years ago. It was different though. They had the gray text on the back and this one, my dears, has that really beautiful aqua tealish green text going right over the back here. I love this combination right here, hell yeah. If you want super in-depth reviews on the Flex collection as a whole, definitely check out my Gymshark playlist. I have quite a few Flex reviews out there, so I don't wanna bore you guys with the extreme review again. So today we're gonna just have a little more fun with the colors, brief overview and things like that. I got a Flex tank that will mix and match with that back logo just mm, perfectly, I know it. Let's see. They love their mixing and matching. So let me show you how I'm gonna style this flex tank. I'm just gonna do a little bit of this, a little grab, a little loop through. Come on, bitch. Little knot, a little pull through, and okay. This way it's high enough so you can see that Gymshark logo. This is such a cute pair, absolutely. Now, if you love this aqua green color as much as me, well then you're gonna really love what's coming up next. Okay, so now we're moving on to the flex shorts, the regular flex shorts and the flex racer back. So now again, we have that elastic band going on. I have to actually touch base real quick on the material. In case you don't know, lately Gymshark's been tweaking the material of some of their classic collections. Now I know they did that with the Vital, they've done that with the Camo. They did slightly do this with the flex here, but I'm gonna be very honest with you. I'm not really feeling a difference. <laughs> Whereas, say, different things like the, the Vital, there was a big difference. Camo, there was a pretty decent difference. The Flex, I'm not really feeling that. And the difference with the material is not that crazy. Their last launch, not the What the Flex, but the one before that, was mostly made of polyamide. And you know I do love that polyamide material. They switched that percent to nylon, straight nylon. Now I know there's nylon in polyamide. They go hand in hand. So I think that's why there's not that crazy of a difference. I'm not even feeling a difference in softness or anything or stretch either. For me, it's nearly indistinguishable. That's just me. It's fit in the same way. Still totally true to size for me. They actually did add in Shark Face logos in this collection a little bit more. They didn't have that on the last launch. It was mostly like a Gymshark full text written down. I actually have a legging from the last launch where you can see there was a little minimal baby Gymshark text down the side here. I always prefer the Shark Face, that's just me. So yeah, little minor changes, but nothing totally crazy. They are coming out with a darker green color. They definitely intended this darker green color to go with the lighter. So you have the same types of colors going on in both greens. You actually have in this darker green, a really light minty logo to match the minty shorts. So don't be afraid to mix and match with this collection. This one you're meant to have fun with. I think the banded shorts are really cute. Again, I prefer the biker only because I'm matted secure right here. So if these pinch in just a little bit, which they kind of do, they pinch in ever so slightly, I get a little tiny baby quad muffin. So I always opt out for the biker. Okay, so let's try on this green full set, full length leggings. I have to be honest, man. These leggings feel so much stretchier than any of the shorts I just tried on. Don't ask. Same material, it's just, it just is what it is. Now I do know, I got in a couple comments about this and I have to touch base. Sometimes you do get a uni butt in the flex, but you gotta treat it like you would any other type of legging that may or may not cause that uni butt. You gotta just play around with that material. My best bet is always just to squat it down, ride it on up. Ooh, <laughs> I think I just, Sometimes you gotta break in those leggings a bit and just, you gotta teach your leggings how you want them to fit, not the other way around, okay? So yeah, trust me, there's a lot of potential with flex looking good around the glutes. You just gotta know how to twerk it. I mean, work it. <laughs> Wait, Ash, didn't they already come out with this green like last year? That's what I thought too, until I grabbed it. 
and then matched it up against here. And if you look closely, the last launch was more of a dark, deep, rich obsidian green. This one right here is more of a lighter green just by a few shades. So I have one full zip. I've never owned a Flex zip, so I'm really excited. I have to share with you guys the coolest looking logo on this, right inside on the collar. So yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, no one could see that logo, but me knowing it's on my neck, that's all that matters. Okay, let's see. Mm. I really love the flex material because there's just a right amount of stretch, right amount of compression. I like the, I really do like the color block because if you're somebody who sweats a lot, you're gonna look like you're sweating even more or it's just gonna conceal your sweat. <laughs> I wish there was pockets here. Damn. <laughs> my hands just wanna go right here. Where are my pockets? Where are they? If you're lifting, I guess you shouldn't be bogging yourself down with things, but guess what? Physically, emotionally, and mentally, I bog myself down with things. That's just how I am. What am I gonna do without my car keys, chapstick, AirPods, cell phone, a tissue in case my nose runs or I wanna spit my gum out? What am I gonna do? And my gum. Yeah, I can't forget my gum pack too. So I need a, a couple pockets. If I'm being honest, this has gotta be one of the coolest zip ups that Gymshark has come out with. I really like the design of this. I feel like the contouring is in all the right places. I feel very muscular in this. <laughs> the Flex Collection, for crying out loud. We are closing the show out with this gorgeous blue. Now, normally I'm more of a warm tone kind of girl, but this blue, you got like purple tones in it. Do you see that tinge of cool, crisp purple mixed in with that really dark, deep, ocean blue. I gotta say, man, on my reel that I showed on Instagram, everybody was just pointing out the blue. I asked, which one did you like the best? Nine out of 10 times, it was this blue color. So we got right here in this hole, we got the regular shorts. I also have a pair of full length leggings. I think they hit it really well with this color combination. The deep blue with the baby blue right here is just it's working. You also have the same tonal baby blue, baby shark face right in the middle here. This whole set is just, it's so balanced and so beautiful. Okay, so I have one long sleeve that I wanna try on really quick. It's in that glitch yellow. And I have a feeling that this heavy contrast is just gonna, oh, damn. I could be wrong, but I feel like these shorts, the bands aren't digging like they usually do. So I don't know if that's different from the last launch. Like I feel like there's a little bit of let up here, which is good because sometimes it could cinch in a little too much and give me like that little pinchy muffin going on, but they're not doing it right now. So hmm. they fit fitting really well. Okay, and the full set with the leggings, perfect length. Girl, I don't know if you noticed this, but the high-waisted flex are really popular among the Hollywood elites. The Hudge, anybody? I'm seeing Vanessa Hudgens in the flex. The girl loves Gymshark flex. I feel like, if I'm being honest, out of everything you saw today, my traditional grab and go for going to a public gym, this is it. The high-waisted, the flexy, strappy sports bra, that is just my comfort right here. Like this is what I go for. I get the most use out of it. And there you have it, that's a wrap. What are we thinking about the new Gymshark Flex colors? I personally love them because I want spring to happen now. Which one is your favorite though? I have to be honest with you, I didn't see this coming, but I'm gonna have to go with this bluish purpley color. Like. I feel like this one though, I feel like it's been a while since we've seen this type of color here. And I'm pretty sure you guys feel the same way. You guys were eyeballing this blue one. I know that I didn't have every single color in every single piece in today's haul, but the idea of this was just to showcase the different colors that will be available. Plenty of playroom to mix and match and have some fun with. Most definitely stay posted because next up we have the new energy that will be launching. Again, a huge thank you to Gymshark for sponsoring today's video and giving me the opportunity to review these pieces. Do your girl a solid and subscribe. It is completely free and helps us out more than you know on this channel. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you found it helpful. Thank you so much for your love and support and I will catch you in my next video.